This is how you can hide the URL address of any website that you're visiting on your laptop. URL address is actually HTTP or www. Whatever website that you're visiting on your laptop, in case if somebody is just sitting beside you and watching the website that you're visiting, this is how you can actually hide the address bar. The person will just be seeing the website, but the person will not be able to know the address bar, which is the URL, HTTP or www. Whatever website that you're visiting. This is actually for security reason. In case if there's any particular website that you're visiting and you don't want your friend or whoever that is sitting right beside you to know the website that you're visiting. The person will be seeing your laptop, seeing what you're doing, but the person will not be able to know the URL address of that website. So let's dive right into my system. Let me show you guys how you can hide it. It's not going to appear on your browser and the browser we are going to use to do this is Google Chrome. Now let's dive right into my system. Okay. Now, first, this is, we're going to use Google Chrome to do this. Okay. So I'm going to show you two steps. Okay. The first one is you can use a command and the second one is quite very simple. Anybody can do it, but on Google Chrome. Okay. Now the first one is by going to search and type run and hit enter now type this code on this window okay you guys can see chrome.exec okay you can see it in front of my screen you can type this once you type this correctly and click on okay it's going to open google chrome you can see google chrome is opened but there's no address bar on your google chrome okay so you can actually create, use this to create any website um, shortcut on your desktop. If it's Facebook or if it's any dating site or any particular website that you're visiting, you can use this to create a shortcut on your desktop. So whenever you click on that shortcut, the website is going to open like this without any address bar or URL address, okay? Now, let me show you how you can do that. Let's go over to Chrome. You guys can see the last thing here is um, Notepad. So just open Chrome. When you open Chrome browser, what you need to do first, if you want to, let's assume you want to create um, a shortcut of, let's say, web, uh, let's say Facebook, okay? You type Facebook, you enter Facebook. Once you enter Facebook, Facebook comes up. The next thing you need to do is come here, this top right corner, click here, come down to more tools, okay, and go to create shortcut. Once you click on create shortcut, you can see Facebook, now click on open window, click on it, and before I click on create shortcut, let me minimize this. You guys can see down below here, there's nothing here, but if I click on create shortcut, you can see it has already created a shortcut. You can see it has opened the window and there's no address bar. So whenever you come here and click on this, okay, you can see this has opened, but there's no address bar. You can log in and do whatever you're doing on your system and nobody will know the website that you're visiting, okay? Let me still go over to Chrome and um, let's say you want to visit like, um, um, let's say zenithbank.com, zenithbank.com and click on enter. Once you click on enter, wait for Zenith Bank um, website to load. Okay, this is Zenith Bank. Okay, continue. You can see this is Zenith Bank. Now come over here again and Come to more tools and click on create shortcuts. Once you click on create shortcuts, you can see. Click here, open a window. If you minimize this, you will see the last thing here is Facebook. It's going to create another shortcut here and click on create. You can see. Now close this. If you double click on this, Zenith Bank, you can see Zenith Bank has opened without any 
address bar no http or www dot whatever thing that you're trying to do none is here everywhere is blank so you can use this method to create a shortcut of any website that you always visit on a regular okay highest is there will be um the sign of the website just on your desktop okay you can still rename it if you like so that whenever you come over to your laptop and click on this shortcut um, icon on your desktop it's going to take you directly to the that particular website so as you mean you're logged in and you saved your password once you click here it will take you directly into your account so that is it and if you're watching my video anyway i hope this video was helpful and if this video was helpful please give it a thumbs up and if you're watching my video for the first time my name is asuki nakinsley and on this channel i give you tips and solutions on how to make money online another relevant tip that helps on our daily online space but during the weekend i make sure i give you updates on new games and app in the virtual reality space so if you wouldn't want to miss any of my videos make sure you hit the subscription button and make sure the notification button is turned on so that you will be the first to know once i upload a new video i will see you guys in my next video like always you guys should stay creative and remain blessed